Hello, I am Squeeze and welcome to an episode of Kingdom Come Deliverance. Now, last time I just got to the monastery in um, Sissau. And now I have a... It's my first time here, so I have a bunch of quests to do. So, like, the main one... Okay, wait, hang on. What's the main one? This one, I think. Yeah. Help in the sick. Uh, find out to get better conditions. Okay, that's the one for the girl I just spoke. Uh, what else? I have to do that. Investigate. That's the, okay. I'm gonna do save that for later. That's like the main quest thing. I can. I kind of wanna leave it for now. And the one I wanna do as well is this one. And I think that's the first one I'm gonna do because it's closest. So a long time ago, there was an incident that happened with the stone. And yeah, and um, it wasn't being delivered or something. I don't know. But apparently, I have to ask this guy, Brother Porter. He might know something about the incident. Right. That. I've been sent here from Talmberg. I'm to speak with the one responsible for construction. That'd be the master builder. Or with our brother, the overseer. What matter is it you're here about? The incident. It has to do with the stone for construction. Ah, then that's a matter of supply. You'll want to talk to the overseer. He knows more about that sort of thing. His study's right above us, more or less. Go up the steps to the left and then head back in this direction, almost the whole way. Right. Let's end that there. So where do I go? Up the stairs, did he say? I think he did, yeah. And I'm looking for some called the Overseer, apparently. Are you him? You sure are. The Overseer. Good health to you. Uh, Sir Divish sent me. Divish. Sir Divish, that's the I one. Have a look the spot I forgot last time what his name is. And why is Sir Divish interested in that regrettable accident? He'd like to know what role the masonry had in it. Or at least its quality. I guess it played a crucial role. But I don't intend to stand in the way of your investigation. I've already made sure the poor man was well taken care of. And that's enough for me. Thank you. I appreciate it. Um. What sort do I ask? Let's just do all of them, I guess. Really? Hand it over. No, I don't have it. No, I'm not the messenger. They sent it earlier. And it still hasn't arrived? It depends on who the letter was passed on to, but I'm sure it will find its way here in the end. Well, that takes too long, doesn't it? Who's in charge of purchasing materials for the construction? Mainly it's me. I pay the fees and make arrangements for delivery, but those in charge of the actual building take care of the rest. I'm not knowledgeable when it comes to the quality of stone. They had the red stone delivered from a long way off. Okay. They take care of storage as well. Yes. But usually, whatever arrives is used up straight away. The construction is in full progress. Yeah, do you remember when the last delivery was? Do you remember when they brought the last delivery of stone? Yes. It rained a lot that week, so they let the carriage sit right outside of the gate on the other side of the wall. It took some time before it was dry enough for further transport. And there wasn't anything strange about it? A little strange, I suppose. Usually, they bring us a large block of stone, which the builders cut to size. This time it was a number of smaller pieces. Okay. No one complained. Just even was different. We saw is less work. I heard you were late with the payment I heard as well. You were late with your payment to the Talmberg quarry. That's true. We ourselves had late payments, and it took some time before we gathered enough money to pay. But that's happened in the past. Okay, fair enough. What? Uh, who are you? Obviously, it's hand. Interesting. So wait, hang on, uh, wrong thing. I now I need to talk to someone else, right? Master Builder, yeah. And he's apparently somewhere around here. Wait, is this you? That's Master Carol, but it must be him then, I guess. I'm honoured that a knight such as you takes an interest in me. Um, yeah, you're to show me about the accident. You're to show me the place where the accident happened. <sighs> like I've got time to spare to show you round. 
He should have done it himself. Why do you want to know? Anyway? So did they send me? Because of the Talmberg stone. Yeah. If they really are delivering poor quality material, then there should be consequences. I'd be interested in what kind. But I'm guessing the Overseer likes the idea of cheaper stone, right? Okay, have you noticed anything going on? And have you noticed anything else going on? Of course. It's a construction site. Things are always going wrong. The men are always complaining and the work isn't being done fast enough. <laughs> so it's just like any other building work? Yeah. Essentially, yes. Occasionally someone brings in bad wood or a man cuts off his thumb and blames it on a bad omen. <laughs> And then there's all these rumors going around. Rumors? I'd be interested to know what the men talk about. Who's been stealing? Which men from the monastery go to visit women? How the work's going? Normal things. It's only the talk about the curse that's not the in curse. the normal run of things. And then there's that devil's skull they dug up. Devil's skull. You talked about the devil's skull? I did. They say it was found in the hole dug for the foundation of the scaffolding. They moved it so it would do its harm elsewhere. But I wasn't there to see it, so I don't know. And who might know more? Who do I need to talk Shouldn't to? Shouldn't you be investigating the stone? Leshek's in charge of the scaffolding, so ask him if I just saw Leshek. He might tell you something. But yeah, you're right. I need to talk about the stone. Who's stealing? Could someone be stealing the stone? According to the rumors. Everyone, from the abbot and the custodian down to the lowest laborer. It's like with whores and dice. There's no protection against slander. And something gets lost here and there, that's true. But nobody stole any stone. There wouldn't be any left if every man here started helping himself, would there? Okay. Let's go back. Uh, show me where the accident happened. Where's the scene of the accident? It didn't happen on the main site. It was at the outbuilding next to the church, right under the long stairs before the entrance door. Ask my assistant who's in charge there. You'll easily recognize him. He dresses up like he owns the place. Right. Look around for clues. Well, I can talk to Leshek because he's this one right here. I guess. And who are you, mate? Just a stonemason, okay. Let's talk to Leshek. Apparently you know about the skull. My respect to you, sir. Uh, no. I heard you found something. It's true. I dug it up during work. I then ran away with it and got rid of it so the others wouldn't see. But rumors spread anyway. And what was it that nobody was supposed to see? What do you think? A demon skull. A demon skull. What'd you do with it? And where is it now? What did you do with it? I, I was taking it down to the river to throw it in. Only, I dropped it at the top of the slope and it rolled downhill. The devil alone knows where it ended up. Okay. Hmm. I'm gonna have to find it. I'll see if I can find it. Okay, that's something to do. So let's just see my uh, quests. So look around for clues. Okay. Sh should I do the skull thing? Yeah, I'll do the skull thing. It's like over there somewhere. Hello, stonemason. You guys just all stonemasons? Yeah, seems like it. Um, is there a way out? There isn't. I want to go down there. Is there not a way through? Oh, the chest. Okay, I'm not going to steal from that. Okay, that, that looks like a door going out. Although I just want to see what's down here. Nothing really is there. I don't know. Uh, let's go down here. This is a big leather. Really fat leather. Anyway. I wanna use this door. Good. So he wanted to drop it in the river, but he dropped it on some sort of slope and it rolled down god knows where. Some he said something like that. Right. Beehive, okay, interesting. Can I get a bee in this game? Um can I get bee? Can I get Honey in this game. Is it a chicken? Anyway, it should be somewhere here, alright. How big is this area that I get to look in? 
Oh, it's not that big. Alright. So, what exactly am I looking Just look for a skull, that's what I'm doing. Hmm. Interesting sight. Oh, what's that? Spirits. I don't know if it would roll down all the way down to the water. I'm not sure. Might investigate anyway. Hmm. So let's actually think about this. So he said he wait. Does this tell me anything in the quest? Just look around the place where Lesha dropped the skull. That's all it says. Um, I hope I don't. Is it something that like I thought it might have rolled down all the way to the water. That's why I'm here. But it doesn't seem like it. Unless I'm missing it. Just looking by these rocks, what was that? Nothing. Okay, I guess it's not in the water then. Okay, let's go back up a second. So where could it have rolled to? Like, it's not under there, is it? No. So he said he dropped it over like a slope at the top somewhere. So if you dropped it here, where would it it would roll down like maybe here? Wait, I'm not even in the area that it could be in. It'd be in the bushes. No, I'm not in the area, like this is like the edge of the area. Yeah, I'm not in it anymore, okay. Hang on a oh, second. Well, that's just quite a big area then, isn't it? Okay, let's check the water first. Okay, no. Okay, so it's not going to be in the water like I thought. I mean, it is a pretty steep hill, so I would have thought it'd roll down all the way down, but... Apparently not. Just double checking. Okay, well it's not in the water. So I guess I'll check like along here. Although I don't see it. No, I didn't see it there. Oh, what's this? Is that it? Devil skull. Hmm. It looks genuine, but I'm not capable of judging. Okay, found it. Now what do I do with it? I have devil skull in my hand. Well, not my hand, my inventory. Take it to the local knacker. Okay, where is that? Where is that? Um. I don't know where the local knacker is, do I? Does it... Oh wait, it does, it does tell me. Hang on, it's all the way down here. Okay, well I'll do this quest first. Is that even local? I mean, it's so far away. I guess it's like, yeah, it's a cell. Okay, so where am I? Can I go in here? Yeah, this is fine, okay. Hello, God. What are you doing? Anyway, I need to go back into the monastery somehow. Oh, there's a nest here somewhere. How did I get in? Oh, there's a wait. The, the door I went in from is here. Right? Yeah, and it's still open. Cool. Whoa. I thought I'd fallen. I mean, I kind of have, but not very far. Let's go up the fat stairs. 
Uh, can I go and hit? No, very hard lock apparently. I kind of want to train my lock picking because there's still a lot of chests I can't open, which is a shame. Okay, so investigate here somewhere, right? Inside? Can I go inside? No, I can't. Um, how close am I to the? I'm not there yet, am I? Do I have to go to the top of this place to investigate? It's kind of what it looked like. Uh, that goes all the way up, right? Yeah, that does. Okay, well, let's scale this place, I guess. Easy chest. Don't want to be opening that. If any lads are a bit quicker. Right. This might not even be the right place. I'm just kind of hoping. I'm, okay, just because if I look at the map one more time. It does look like it's up, doesn't it? It really looks like that. Okay, so let's go up again. And again. Am I nearly at the top? Not yet. If I fall now, I die. Pretty sure. I already hope this is the last one. It looks like I'm near the top. Yep. Okay. This is interesting. And I get the feeling I can, it's not the right place. Well, I may as well open the chest. I don't want to come here for nothing, do I? Um, it's over here. Oh. There you go. Was it worth? No, it wasn't. Anyway, that, that must be something cool up here, right? Tell me I didn't climb up here for nothing. Really? Okay, I guess it's not the right place then. I mean, it does kind of look like it. Look. Hmm. Oh, I was meant to go on my quest. Oh. It doesn't give me any clues, does it? You know what? Fine. In that case, I'm going to fast travel all the way here. I think. Yeah. Damn it, I was really hoping I could fast travel from that location. It would have saved a lot of time. Anyway, let's go down here. I think this is a different ladder. Oh, and this is some long ladder as well. Where does this take me? Oh, my, like... That's where I was going up, wasn't it? Just making sure there's nowhere I can go. I jump down here? Oh, I did anyway, I just lost some stamina, but that's fine. If I can jump down instead of climbing down, that's so much better. Doesn't look like it. I'm gonna have to climb down the rest of it. Yeah, it's too high. I'm gonna injure myself doing that. Um, that chest is too close to other people, I'm not gonna open it. Although I am highly tempted, but no. Let's be good. Yeah, screw it, let's jump down. I just lost some stamina, I could have jumped the whole way. Oh well, who are you? Smola. Anyway, I have stuff to do. I don't know, do I give up on this? I think I will for now. Anyway, um, 
Let's do that. That's not too far. Get my horse. Where's my horse? There you are. So this is like the last thing I need for Lady Stephanie. Uh, do I fit under this? I should, yeah. That's cool. Okay, so I haven't explored this area before, so it's nice to see something new. Okay, there's a blacksmith and stuff. That's nice. When do I fit through here? I think I do. Yeah. Sometimes if you don't fit through something like that, it will actually kick you off the horse. Okay, it's open. Um, I don't see a guy. Is he upstairs? Okay, someone's here. Master Jerome. Florian, okay. Well, Master Jerome. Can you help me? I hope I can be of help to you, Knight. I hope so too. The lady of, the lady of yeah. Talmberg, sir. That. She wants me to find out why the crown's been delayed. But through no fault of ours, I can tell you that. So why? We had a large stone ordered for mounting on the crown, a beautiful Moldavite from South Bohemia that we had cut and polished in Prague. But, well, in short, the well, merchant, Martin Wiesek, who was supposed to bring it from Prague, got lost along the way. It's like the ground swallowed him up. Hmm. Lady Stephanie won't be happy. No, she won't. Look, we've got something else here we can replace the stone with. But I'm sure even you can see it's not worthy of a noble wedding. Then don't do it. Definitely not worthy of our fine craftsmanship. Oh, if I only had someone who'd try to find the mold of it. Well, I'm here. Why don't you just ask me? Of course I'll try to find the stone. Just tell me where the fellow was seen last. Well, that fellow, as you call him, the esteemed merchant, Martin Wiesek, was last seen riding alongside the Sassau River. Okay. Passing by the footbridge over the ford, to the west of here. I can find Evidently, that. Evidently, he never made it to Sassau town. Hmm. Hopefully well, he's not I'll dead. Look for him, but he could be far over the mountains by now. Or under the ground. Alright. Um. What's this? Alright, so it's all the way over there. Mm, okay. Uh, let's just do this first. What? I can't fast travel? What do you mean? Is it because I'm indoors? Can I do it now? Yes I can. That's quite a big town. I'm about to see it, hang on. How did I even get this fast level fast travel location? I've never even been here. Oh, this is cool. It's a big town. Well, Australia, I've noticed this guy has a star on him. I want to see what he does. Oh, it's a bailiff. Okay. I'm honoured that a knight such as you takes an interest in me. What's happening around here? Is there anything interesting going on here? Well, there's two good for nothings from Scarlet's who are a thorn in my side. It's one thing sympathizing with them after what happened. I wonder who. But it's another when they get mixed up in all kinds of mischief. I'll catch them red-handed sooner or later. When I do, they'll be sorry they crossed me. Is that it? Is there anything interesting going on? I already asked that, but... It's so peaceful. Ah, oh, apart from those two. It's fine. Okay. So is that a clue? That maybe there's something I can do about that? Or a guard? Um, where am I going? What am I doing? I'm looking for someone. The local knacker, yeah. It's a tailor. Um, knacker should be this way. Yeah, I'm getting close. Oh, food. How am I for food? Uh, I can eat something, sure. Alright. Are you the knacker? Grave digger. Here you are. Cool. I'm honored that a knight such Why does everyone say that? It's just because I'm dressed like a knight. This skull. I found this skull. People are saying it's the skull of a demon, but I don't know. It certainly looks like it. With the horns and all. Well, 
Let's see. Those are deer antlers. Oh. Someone's fixed to this human skull. Yeah, it's not going to be a it's devil skull. Devil. Just a bit of devilry. I'm glad to hear it's not the real thing. Someone must have put it there deliberately, knowing that's where they were due to dig. And they put a lot of work into it, too. The horns are held on tight, even though it was lying in water. Mm. Whoever did this was skilled bugger, and no mistake. Okay. So it wasn't a real devil skull. I mean, I didn't think it was anyway. Uh, I could just, I could have a little look around the town, I guess. I mean, why not? Uh, let's get out of the farm area. Let's go to the main bit. Okay, you thought to the scaffolder again. Oh, there's an armor right here. It's interesting. Trader. Trader. I'm just having a look. Alright. Another trader, okay. What's going on here? Watchman. Not interested. Kind of want to find the tavern. Hmm. Also, the two guys that um, the bailiff mentioned that were originally from Scarlet, so I kind of want to find them. See what's going on with them. Florian, that seems like a familiar name from this game. Um, People, townswomen, you look homeless. You don't even have a name or anything. Okay. Show yourself. You show yourself. I'm right here. That was a grindstone. What is this place? Weaponsmith. Right, I thought so. Um, is there really like no tavern or anything? I mean, does I know there's a lot of the town that I haven't really seen. Yeah, more in the centre. Okay, let's go back to the centre, kind of. Yeah, that was quite lazy, wasn't it? Just far shoveling that a little bit. Oh well. It saves time, so I'm not complaining. So subscribe. You might be interesting. Good day to you. What do you name? Good day to you too. Alright, let's talk traders at it. Oh, he's gonna have loads of books. Okay. Jesus, so much stuff. I could sell him the books I've already read. That's, that's quite cool. But I'm not going to. So. Now, what's this place? It looks kind of like fortified. So, what is that? And where's the entrance to it as well? I guess this is the entrance? Is this, is this the tanner? Maybe, I don't know. How do you get in this place? Okay, right here. Oh, that's a church, okay. You're a townswoman, right? Yes, you are. It's been down there. Okay, no, I'm not gonna do that. Let's check this place out. Okay, I've apparently seen that. It's a grocer. This is what? No, nothing. Probably still part of the grocer. It's a baker, okay. And this is the tavern right here. Village of innkeeper. Or gambler. Why aren't you playing dice? I'll I, I play dice with you. If you're up for it. Yeah, let's see what the innkeeper has to say. He, he often has some interesting stuff. Oh, I could get a room as well. My respects to you, sir. Yeah. Are there any problems around here I might be able to help with? Well, depends what you're willing to do. 
Anything? There was one troublemaker around here not long ago. We dealt with him. He was selling some relics he claimed were miraculous. There was nothing but worthless trinkets. Interesting. Sent the bloody swindler packing so fast you couldn't see his heels with dust. All the way to Ledechko, I believe. I want to find him. I reckon he won't last Sounds interesting. There either. That's all I can think of. Okay. I might look for someone in Ledechko then, in that case. I would play some dice, but no one's playing. Okay. Who, what's this? Charlatan. Okay. Who are you? Ah, I know you. Do you? I know you from somewhere. Hmm. Where do I know you from? Uh, I'd, I'd want to know. Of course, my dream. Yeah, right. You were in a boat made of bone, and I put a crown of thorns on your head. Tell me about your dream. All right. Tell me about this dream of yours. It's probably making up, but I'm curious. That dream. Yes. That dream has come true. I dreamt that a young man would become no. my apprentice. My own pupil in the trade of miracles. Yeah, you can't Nothing be serious. Be me. Oh, well. What's your name, young man? Henry. 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 Hmm. A powerful name. A powerful name, is it? So, All right. Henry. Are you ready to become my apprentice? Who even are you? First, tell me. Who are you, and what do you do? Me? I am an unworthy, low, and miserable servant of Providence. Scholar or merchant? Believer or Can you just give me a straight answer? I wander the world without home or family, with only my wagon offering miracles to those that that's who I am. Without home or kin, I wander this world with my wagon, providing the miracles that people need. Ointments, relics, aromatic herbs, rare spices, talismans, and animal right, luck. All these things... You sound like a scammer to me. What exactly does it entail, becoming your apprentice? A lot of work and strenuous labor. Knowledge of medicine, theology, and white magic. Yeah, I don't study the think I want to do this. Works of the ancients and devote your time to understanding your fellow men, listening to them, and learn to read their souls. So the thing is, I don't really want to do this, but I'm going to accept it just to yeah, see what serious. happens. I probably won't end up doing it though. God has sent you. So what do you say? So yeah, I probably will end up actually doing it, but I just agree for fun. All right, I'll be your apprentice. Wonderful! Oh, glorious day! I have a successor in my work. So, how do you plan to start training me? With a test of your practical skill. Oh. I have my eye on three rare. Do you want me to steal stuff? Great value. But sadly, they're a little difficult to obtain. I'm not a thief. I'm, just I mean, so clear, I am. But, I'm not stealing yeah. anything for you. Who said anything about stealing? You said these are valuable things you're after. I don't suppose you can just pick them up anywhere. Valuable for me because I know their power and strength. For an ordinary mortal, they barely mean anything. Oh. Right. Well, that's fine. What exactly do you want? First, I need a tooth of Saint Procopius. What? Then I'll need a branch from a topping out hung on a church. And finally, a talisman for luck from a passionate player. Bloody hell, that's a lot. All right, one thing at a time. How do I get that? So a tooth. About that tooth. It's going to be slightly more complicated, isn't it? I know. Yes, it would be very difficult to gain such a rare relic, of course. That's why I have an alternative solution. What's that? I'm listening. A layman named Procopius lives by the monastery, and it just so happened, thanks to my intricate medical knowledge, that I found out he has a sick tooth. Am I going to have to pull it out? 
And how am I supposed to get the tooth? I haven't the faintest idea. Oh, you have God. to think of something. But maybe you'll be able to persuade him to let the blacksmith pull. Fine. I'll see what I can do. Wonderful. I mean, it's, it's a weird thing to do, though, isn't it? Uh, yeah, that. This topping out. What's that? <laughs> You're not a carpenter, it seems. No. No, I'm a blacksmith. I see. Well, a topping out is a decorated spruce or a conifer tree hung on top of the roof of a new house to bring good fortune and God's blessing. Okay. That topping off is hung pretty high, isn't it? Exactly. Naturally. It hangs on the rooftop according to tradition. And the church is tall. And how am I supposed to get it down? Damned if I know. But I they mean, had to get it up there somehow, didn't they? They're not very helpful, are they? I mean, you are very helpful, are you? I'll get it. And the last thing was what? The talisman, right. This player's talisman. Where am I supposed to find it? I actually have a specific one in mind. Right. Here at the inn, there's a dice player who always has a cat's paw with him. That's supposed to bring him luck. Okay, I can do dice. How am I supposed to get the talisman from him? I haven't a clue. It won't be easy, but I'm sure you'll find a way. He just says the same thing to we'll everything. See. I'll get it then. Very well. I'll get you the poor. I'll get looking for those Jesus. things then. This reminds me of a... Um, Excellent! You do that, my journeyman. Good luck. I was going to say, this reminds me of Lady Stephanie's quest. Like, she told me to bring three things to her. You can teach me that. Oh, pickpocket thing. That's interesting. Teach me how to pickpocket better. Certainly. Slightly advanced. I'm interested in more advanced techniques. All right, but it'll cost. How much? Yeah, no, I'm gonna haggle with it. Isn't that quite a lot? I know I can afford it, but I'm haggling anyway. Still like 140, I guess. Agree. That's a poor offer. That's a poor offer. I've never heard that one before. Okay, I'll meet you at like 155. My last offer. That's not enough. What? Fine. Agree. Now, listen up. Okay, I improved pickpocketing. That'll do. So, I wonder if this guy happens to be the guy with the poor. I can talk to him now, that's new. God be with you. You must be that lucky fellow everyone. Oh, so it is him. Lady Luck has been good to me lately, true enough. But that can change quicker than you know. People say that you get help from a lucky charm. Is that not allowed? No, it is. It just interests me, that's all. Why? I want it. Should I just say straight up, let's play for it? <laughs> yeah, let's play for it. I'd like to try that luck of yours. Let's play for your talisman. <laughs> As you wish. My talisman against your grocery. Sure thing, how much groshen? Sure. Sure. 100 is nothing to me. Um, what do I want to use? That one. That one. And both of these, I think. Yeah. What does this do? No, that's not that's a bad one, isn't it? Yeah. Confirm. Alright. I don't like this at all. Just do that. But I wasn't happy with that. Mm. Let's try something different. These are the ones that I've left have a high chance of. I'm gonna risk it again. Have a high chance of rolling something that is useful. Oh, damn it! Bust. That was like a one in three of failing, and it happened. Oh well. I believe I got this. This will be the one. Oh, I see a bunch of fives. That's so bad. I mean, no, good for him, but not for me. There's nothing here. 
just that. Um, that's a bust. How is that even possible? Jesus. The odds must have been so low of that happening. This will be the one. I hope I can play again, like as many times as I want until I win. No. Um. I don't know what to do. Let me just take that. Wait, what is going on? Is, I swear there's nothing, is there? Is there anything that I can take? Honestly, I'm not sure. I didn't. I could have sworn there was nothing there to take. Oh, he's got a thousand. Oh no! I thought he had three ones. I missed. This no. Will be the one. Never mind. That's a. Oh, he's got a five. I didn't see that. This will be the one. He's got a one, two ones actually. We'll see. Right, I need to put some points on the board. All right, mate, calm down. That's it. That's risky, and it's it's actually paid off for him. That's annoying. Hmm. I hope he busts. That's not a bust. He's gonna lose this whole round if he busts. I think that's it. What the hell's with these damn dice? You're rolling too much. You don't know when to stop. I'm actually gonna take both of that. Both of them. Um, yeah, let's just risk it. There you go. And keep going. Because I've used up all my dice. Oh, that looks good. Bang, bang, bang. And bang. There you go, 1,501 go. That's what I was waiting for. Patience is key, apparently, in this game. Now you. You, you took 150 and left it there. That was poor from you. Not complaining, though. No. I'm just going to take that. Just looking how much I need. Much. I need 300 more to finish this whole thing. You know, I'll just take that. I'm only 100 off. As long as he doesn't have like some massive luck, I got this. That's it. I just need to roll a single one, which is actually the chances for that are quite high. I'm pretty sure. Finished. And yep. There it is. Give me your lucky talisman. Well, seems my luck's run out. Damn it. Seeing how I lost. I reckon that cat's paw don't bring luck anymore. <laughs> Not for you, anyway. Yeah, so, it's gonna bring luck to me now. Game. Cat's paw. Can I only just have a look at this in my inventory? So it's, it must be a quest item. No, it's not worth anything, it's just... For luck, or maybe not. Uh, anyway, that was interesting. Uh, I'm also going to end the episode right here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, I would appreciate any sort of feedback. And I will see you again next time.